Guys, a cell phone, an iPad, and a laptop, right? How do you target leads using a mobile or your cell phone on Google Ads? I bet you any money, right, guys, that most of people's traffic for their business is coming from mobile devices. You need to know how to best and successfully target leads, clients, and customers using a mobile device on Google. And we've done over 24,000 leads on Google, and I'm gonna share with you my real Google Ads account, peel back the curtains, and show you how to use a mobile device to target leads using Google. Guys, let's dive in. So guys, here we are inside of one of my Google Ads real accounts, guys. And this is the biggest mistake people make is they waste a lot of money on just targeting desktops or iPads when the real traffic and the real gold mine is actually in mobile devices, guys. Most of your traffic, I pretty much guarantee, will be coming from a mobile device. And I don't care whether you sell, I don't know, rugs, shoes, tennis rackets, or whether you offer cleaning services, insurance, or you're a real estate agent. Most of the traffic these days from Google are coming from mobile devices. And, this, and in this free training, I'm going to show you how you can target mobile devices only using Google and how to write an ad that is inside of Google that only targets mobile devices. Guys, you will make a lot more money. You will convert more traffic. You will get more sales and more leads if you know these tips I'm going to share with you on trying to target mobile devices only okay so as you can see we've done over 26,000 conversions using mobile device targeting only using Google and we've been in front of 38 million people guys on mobile devices so first thing I'm going to do guys is I'm going to share with you a mobile way of accessing this data so the first thing you're going to need to do if you don't use Google Ads already or you've started using it first thing you're gonna to need to do is you're gonna to need to download the free Google Ads app now let me dive in and let me show you how to access this data from Google firstly before we get into how to write your ads for mobile devices and how to do your targeting and all that good stuff. So let's dive in and let me show you the device on a mobile phone on how it looks when it comes to targeting um, mobile devices using Google. So guys, the first thing you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to open up your Google Ads app, okay? And then you're gonna need to click on your campaign name. When you click on your campaign name, at the very, very top right, there's a settings gear icon. If you click on the icon, Google will show you your campaign settings for your particular campaign. And it doesn't matter if you offer services or products, it works exactly the same, no matter what business you are. Now, near the bottom, you're going to see something that's called devices. What you need to do is you need to click on devices. And then once you click on devices, you will see a list of different types of devices. And it's called computers, mobile, tablets, and TV screens. Now, this free training here I'm telling you about now, this is all about mobile devices. This is where most of you are going to get most of your traffic from. And it's where you're going to get your conversions from. Now, the second one down, you can see mobile devices. Now, this is one of our um, campaigns that we are currently running. As you can see, we've been shown in front of 38,000 people already using a mobile device. Now, here's what you want to do, which is really, really important and what a lot of people make huge mistakes on, is you want to discontinue and you want to devalue all the other devices other than mobile devices so where you can see the blue button where it says add you simply click add 
and you would turn on your bid adjustment and you would put in there 100 but then you would do it as a minus so you're telling google that you do not want to bid or want any traffic from computers now you do that for tablets and tv screens and you only have mobile on and that is the best way to target mobile devices now let's jump back onto my uh, account on my desktop and let me show you how to now write a google ad only for mobile devices so guys here we are inside of my google ads account and this is where this is where it gets really exciting right so this is where you can actually start writing your ad um, for a mobile device only now let me just move my face here now a couple of things that you are going to need to do right firstly is can you see on the right hand side here you've got the desktop preview and you've got the mobile preview very 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 important guys you want to click the mobile preview section okay now this is where you're going to write your ad for a mobile device only now once you have that set up um, and you've got your mobile ad um, page on Google right in the right place in the right um, area to start writing your ad what you need to do now is you need to now open up another tab okay guys and go to what's called the key Google keyword planner okay now this is really really important now this is where a lot of people make huge mistakes and this is where they massively fall down you need to be very careful in how you're selecting the right keywords now this works for any business any service any products that you that you are offering so in this example i'm going to pretend that i offer a cleaning service or a house cleaning service business I teach a lot of um, commercial and, and cleaning companies inside of our Google coaching program um, about this stuff. So it makes it a really good example to use. So house cleaning services. Now there are 90,000 people in uh, the US that are searching for house cleaning services uh, on Google. So this makes it really, really important. And have you noticed as well, year on year change it's up 22 percent so it's a growing keyword guys okay now this is the keyword i'm going to use so i'm going to go back over to my uh my page where i'll start creating my mobile device now remember guys you've got to make sure you have this here the mobile preview switched on and this is how your ad is going to look on a mobile device only. And a couple of really, really, really top tips here, guys, is what really, really works so well from the testing that me and my clients inside of our Google coaching program have done is using things like numbers works really well. Question marks work really well. Offers work really well. Saying in your ad, that you are local to them works really really well on a mobile device now let's do some of those examples okay so in this example i am a house cleaning uh, i offer house cleaning services now what you could as i as i said earlier we could use the word local so things like local discounts questions prices all work really well do you need cleaning services question mark perfect do you need cleaning services 20 percent off Twenty percent off house cleaning service yeah so i'm including things that i know from the testing that we've done works extremely well on mobile devices people want to know um, if, they, if you are local, they want question marks, they want offers, they want discounts, all this type of stuff really works well. And you can even say in your ad, call, call us from your mobile or sell. 
out. Because you know that you're targeting only mobile devices. So you can encourage people, right, to um, to sell. To, to, so you can encourage people to call you from their mobile device because that is how they're calling you. Now, look, 20% off house cleaning service. Local house cleaning services, okay? Can you see how it's really showing up here? And that is how you want to start to develop and and, 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 and write your headlines on your ads now go back to your keyword planner and start to pick out niches right start to pick out more low volume low hanging fruit because another big mistake people make and i teach this all the time to our students inside of our google coaching program is that they go after the big massive shiny keywords guys and you do not need to do that okay you don't need to do that. So what you need to do is start looking down and start looking at different... Uh, look, so there's one. Look look at this. 174% up year on year. So deep cleaning. So you can start to add this into your headline because we know people want it. People are searching for it. So you could even say deep cleaning for your house. And, and again, on, do you want a deep clean? Question mark. Perfect. And again, you could put something along the lines of 20% off all deep cleaning now. That's a great headline, okay? So, and you can start to see how it looks on a mobile device. Okay, local house cleaning services, 20% off house cleaning service. So you can start, call us now from your cell phone. Do you want a deep clean? Can you see guys, can you see I'm, I'm incorporating things that work really well on cell phones, work well on mobile devices. And this is the mindset you've got to get into when you start to develop and use a mobile and cell and mobile devices and cell devices to start, um, targeting your potential clients and customers and leads using a mobile device on Google. This is powerful, powerful stuff, guys. We've got people, our students, our clients inside of our Google coaching program that have gone on to do six and multi-million dollars each year by targeting only mobile devices. And they are saving a bunch of money because they are excluding and, and removing desktops and computers and iPads, okay? So, another really cool piece here. Now, everything I've just spoke about, question marks, discounts, local, um, we need to now put this all into a, um, um, into a long, detailed description that's gonna show really, really well on a mobile device. Top tip for you here, guys, is the more descriptions you can add the more real estate it takes up on the mobile device Google listings. So, so when somebody pulls out um, pulls out that their their cell phone, okay, and they start typing in um, house cleaning services on their phone, then what will happen is your ad will get bigger because you've got more content in the description, which means you're more likely to get the click. Okay, hopefully this is all making sense, guys. If not, if you want more information on this, so you're not quite getting stuff, go and check out the description below. There's a there's a link to a bigger free training on, on Google, okay? So let's write some uh, descriptions now. Now, question marks work well, we already know that. Do you want a deep clean in your home? 20% off all house cleaning services, local deep, local deep cleaning, local deep clean, local, okay, so you've got to play around with the words sometimes to make sure they fit, perfect, 90 out of, so you've got 90 characters that Google allows you to use. Now, what I've tried to do in this is I've included all the things I know works well on a mobile device. Question mark, do you want a deep clean in your home? Question mark, 
20% off all house cleaning services, local services. You've got to think about your business, guys, and your service, what service you offer, what products you offer, and you incorporate what I'm telling you now for your own business. So you might offer pet insurance. Do you need pet insurance? Local pet insurance providers, 20% off. Call us from your cell. Our, we care about pets. Yeah? Hopefully you're getting all this and it makes sense. So you've got to use the keyword planner, guys. You've got to do a little bit, bit of research and you don't have to go after the big, shiny words, you know, big, massive search volumes. Um, and as you can see, look, it's now got quite a big space here. Do you want to 20% off cleaning? Um, it's all included in the headlines. So I'm off with deep cleaning now because we went to our keyword planner. We looked at deep cleaning, 27,000 searches a month, guys. And all of this um, it gets put into your ad. Now, all of this that I'm teaching you and showing you is just a, a part of what I do for our students and clients inside of our Google coaching program, guys. So I teach all this stuff, but on a, in a much deeper level. And it's what got us... 38 million people and over 26,000 leads, right? So, and as you can see, I spent over 480,000. I spent over, so this works about over 500, half a million dollars I've spent testing this, okay? I spent over half a million dollars testing different devices. So, guys, um, hopefully you find this interesting. I say free training right now. Go and click on the link. Go and watch the webinar. Go and watch the training listen to me talk on about about google and how it how powerful it can be for your business so hopefully guys you find this really interesting and hopefully take care and i will see you on the next training and don't forget to subscribe guys subscribe and you can get more of this free training if you liked it okay speak to you soon see ya